it's gone amazing so far. It's really cool just because like having put the album out just like a few weeks ago kind of makes this like the launching point for it and it's like the perfect thing to do that for because like there's so many people that come out to this show and like there's tons of overlap for fans of different bands to like potentially come and see us and it's just really great and it's been a blast so far. It's got lots of people on stage, you are uh, you know pretty much a solo act. Mm -hmm. I mean, how has that been with the other bands? Are there any mentorships, friendships, um, artistic uh, uh, collaborations going on? Uh, yeah, we have tons of friends on tour. Like there's like uh, probably like 10 bands on this tour that we've toured with in the past. Just like really good friends of ours. So it's been it's been really fun so far. Uh, it's just like the, the first year we did it, we only had um, a few people we knew on the tour, but this time it's like everybody's out with us. So it's just like summer camp kind of. We're extremely comfortable on the Warped Tour. We've officially done the Warped Tour more than any other band. Yeah. And on this tour, we will actually be hitting our 365th Warped Tour date. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. That's a lot of work. Yeah. That's a lot of catering and a lot of that's fun. that's a year that's a year of standing in line at catering. It's when awesome. You're not on tour, where do you guys call home? Uh, I live in Connecticut, but Roger lives in Gainesville, Florida. Yeah, the band's based out of Gainesville, Florida. Gainesville, Florida is where home for us is. And you know, since you've done this for so many times, you're meeting a lot of these bands and I mean, do you feel like there's some mentorship going on or does everyone come in here? Yeah, they're re they're really teaching us a lot out here yeah, actually. They're letting, yeah. They're letting they're us know. Done. Yeah. They let us, they, they tell us how old we are. Not by saying we're old, they go, man. I used to love you guys in junior high. Yeah. And then it's like a 25 year old guy with a giant beard. Yeah. Like, oh, thanks. Damn, it's great. How do you get the secret to staying together so long? There's so many bands don't, don't have staying power. We arm wrestle a lot. Like most bands, they like, they, they won't talk to each other. But if there's a, a conflict between us, we arm wrestle. That's the key to it, arm wrestling. We do, we do communicate a lot and uh, try to kick down anything that's like bothering anyone. I think that like just talking between band members like about any kind of problem is something that like the younger bands maybe are too egotistical or something that doesn't happen. You know? That's why some of those bands break up. Talking, that's important. Talk talking is important.